Hi! What is up, peeps? It's Web from again. Welcome to part three of Undertale. Last time I died facing these guys. And I guess all the effort I put into doing Lesser Dog was a waste. So this is Do. I forget their name. It's Dogie, I know that. What's that smell? Where's that smell? Yeah. I probably ended this too early, but yeah. Hmm. Here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Dogi assaults me. Doga me and Doga wrestle. Roll around. Roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Number two nuzzle champs. 98. Of course we were second. I died again? I've had him a couple times, just so he's there. Dang it. Yeah, his his head lifts up. Whoops. Yeah. All the stuff I did last episode was a waste of time. Actually, maybe it wasn't. The video is longer now, but. It's probably longer than I thought it was, but still. I'm gonna eat before I... I'm gonna eat something before this starts again. Monster candy. You ate the monster candy, your HP was maxed up. Let's kick human tail. Do humans have tails? Roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Take my wife's food. Don't actually. Okay, I can do this one. Roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Reset. The dog sniff you again. After rolling in the dirt, you smell all right. What? It smells like a- Are you actually a little puppy? No. Pet. You pet Dogami. Wow, pet by another puppy. Well, don't leave me out. I love this attack because I can actually do it. Pet. You pet the dog wrestle. What about me? The dog that pets dogs is amazing. Yay! 40 gold. Dogs can pet other dogs. A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more important, is there any left for me? Aiden. Really? Wowee! No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, fret not, human. I'm Master Chef Papyrus. Will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> yeah. Next time there's a safe point, I am saving. My brother started a sock collection recently. How sad me. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this one was so hard. Human! Hmm. How do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different, and as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. 
I suppose what I am saying is, worry not, human, I, the great papyrus, will solve this conundrum when we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Oh, I think I can do it. I think I know how. Yeet. First try. Wow, you solved it, and you did it all without my help. Incredible. Impress. You must... Impressive, I don't know. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. <laughs> Sorry if my voices for the characters are different. Hi, Sans. Maybe he does wear socks, huh? Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Hey! It's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through them if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery, and you will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Stop on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Nope, but I feel like it won't be too. Great! There's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. Yeah, <laughs> get ready. Uh, this is gonna be impossible. So you can walk on pink tiles, right? The machine isn't working. Okay. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier, it wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. Good thing I didn't eat it. Hey, it's Lesser Dog. This dog is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. Oh, his neck... It, I didn't pet him as much this time, so his neck isn't as long. That sucks. I spent all that time petting him. Knowing that dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog fills you with determination. Someone told me if you pet his, if you pet him, his neck will grow, and then when he builds the sculptures, they'll be everywhere. That kind of sucks. On the floor inside is a box of pomeranians. Aware of dog, please pet dog. This dog is there. Oh, okay. Let's talk to this girl. That dog considers itself an artist, but does never know what to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. Wait, how long have I been doing this? Alright, so about 10 minutes, I don't know. Sands and papyrus. Okay. What? Oh, wait. Let me look at it for a second. Okay. I think I get it.
Yay! What's up? Undecorate. You remove a childhood photograph of Snowdrake and his parent. That's a little better. You remove a small, confused dog. That's a little better. Undecorate. You remove the striped cane that says I used this tiny cane to walk on. A weight has been lifted. Well, that's really creepy. Me and Seth were using Photoshop, not Photoshop, Photo Booth on his iPad, and we used the mirror thing. My guy looked exactly like that. Wait, so Sans is over there and over there. I think he teleports. I don't know. Sorry, are you following me? Yeah. It's a door. What a tiny dog house. What? What's that? Oh, it's a dog. Well, it's not lesser dog. It's the greater dog. Hold on. I'll be right back. Hold on, guys. So, back to You call the greater dog. It bounds towards you, flecking slobber into your face. Oh, okay. So then... Pet. 
Dirty dog curls up in your lap as it is pet by you. It gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Then it wakes up. It's so excited. Whoa. Greater dog is patting the ground with its front paws. You make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. You ate the monster candy. You recovered 10 HP. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight onto you. Your movement's slow, but you still haven't pet enough. Pet capacity is 40%. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. You won, you're in 0 XP and 40 gold. Okay. Aww. It licked my face! Sorry you guys had to wait like that, but I had to look up how to do it, because I heard it was really tough. Hold on, I know there's something cool you can do if you go this way. Uh, I didn't go far enough, I guess. Oh, whoops, too far. Sans has a huge head. Human, this is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the, ga the gauntlet of deadly terror. Why is there dogs everywhere in this game? When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm uh, I'm about to activate it now. That uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah. We can't use this one. I, I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Anyway, away it goes. Phew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. Hey. Hey. I'm gonna go back now. Flowey! He was there! This is gonna be a longer episode because I was gone for too long. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. I understand them, but it's hard. Welcome to Snowden. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Sorry, I forgot to read it like that, but shop. Oh, I love this song! Hello, traveler. How can I help you? I'll buy something. What would you like to buy? Manly bandana. Cinnamon bunny. Oh. So. Huh? Sell something. Does this look like a pawn shop? I don't know how it works where you come from, but if I started spending money on old branches and used bandages, I'd be out of business in a jiffy. Talk. Say hello. Hiya! Welcome to Snowden! I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? You want to know what to do here in Snowden? Grillbees has food. And the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, 
You can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them, brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Town history. Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages, so unless you're a ghost or can burrow under the door, forget about it. I've already been there. Victoria. <laughs> Life is the same as usual, a little claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? Next. Bye now, come again sometime. The start of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Dang it, I read it wrong again. Use the box. Yeah. I'm gonna keep my snowman piece in there. And I'm gonna use the manly bandana. You equip the manly bandana. Info. Brandon, Shields 10 HP has already been used several times. Wait, what does... What does the stick weapon stick armor manly bandana item? Oh, okay. I'm not going in the end because I don't need to stay there. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. Teehee. Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Grief truck. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. Yo! You're a kid too, right? I can tell, because you're wearing a striped shirt. Okay. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. Papyrus and his undying? Oh, the dogs are here. That's cool, it's that dude. Those guys. Doggy. Greater dog and lesser dog. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. What? Those dogs are part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. Da, 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 da. Grilled said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. Capital's getting pretty crowded. So I've heard they're gonna start moving here. Hmm. I don't want to see the erasure of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip onto their butts. Hmm. Is it human food different from what? from monster food? It does things like spoil, and when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help, I want new drinks here and <laughs> hot guys. I'm leaving. Everyone is always laughing at well. <coughs> Everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crisis. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? 
we can't do anything, so why be morose about it? Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, my patience rewards me. Ah, to be young again. The world sure fate. The world sure felt boundless. You aren't going to make me be the human again, are you? Let's play monsters and humans! That's creepy, kind of. <laughs> the library. Welcome to the library! Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. <coughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches. When they ran out of assignments, I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. That look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumbo, aren't you? Probably. Because I've never done it. This mailbox is labeled Papyrus. Look inside. It's empty. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. I'm guessing that's sans, because I've heard he's too lazy to do anything. It's locked. It's locked from the inside. What does this do? Well, that's helpful. I did want to save anyway. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. I read it wrong again. Okay. Hope you guys enjoyed that episode. Um, I think episodes 2 and 3 have been shorter, but next episode, I'll try to make it longer. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll see you peeps later. Bye!